Good morning, this is Karen. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can change your settings for cutting vinyl or any other media in Silhouette Studio and how to save your own custom settings. So the first thing you want to do when you're testing with vinyl is to just create a small object, put it up in the corner of your mat or your material so that you don't waste too much material. But the thing is that with different types of vinyls, if you're not getting exactly what you need with the preset settings that are in Silhouette Studio, then you're going to need to test a little bit. And you'll end up wasting a bit of the vinyl that you want to use because you need to test with the actual vinyl. I find that on my machine, a setting of one, um, a blade setting of one works best. And if you wanted to adjust the thickness, then you would do that over here. You can move the slider up and down. You can move the arrow buttons up and down to do that. And if you're finding that your blade is skipping over portions where it should be cutting, then you need to adjust your speed as well. You need to adjust your speed downwards. I'm going to show you what the standard setting is for vinyl in Silhouette Studio. The standard is a blade depth of 2, a thickness of 9, and a speed of 8. So as I said, I find that my Cameo cuts best with a blade setting of one. I'm going to adjust the thickness just a little bit um, because it's almost perfect. I'm just going to change it by one notch and the speed is fine for me. I'm not getting that problem. So now to save this as a custom media, all I need to do is click this plus sign next to custom media and give it a name. So I'm going to call this one Oracle 631 and I'm going to type matte vinyl in parenthesis to remind me that that's what this one is. And when I press tab, it will have been saved. You'll see that over here. Now you'll see under custom media, I have Oracle 631. I can go back down to my custom media, uh, sorry, I can go back down to the vinyl setting that was in your software when you received it and you'll see that the settings are back to what it was. Whatever you change, that's where they are. This one, my custom setting has not been saved completely because I haven't cut it yet. So I'm going to go back and I'm going to change my speed back to 8 and I'm going to move my thickness down. I had said um, I think I had said also eight, just the one notch down. So I'll save it that way. And I'm just going to cut click. Now my Cameo is not attached right now, or it's not turned on, I should say. So it's going to give me an error, but it will be enough to be able to change. Sorry, it will be enough to be able to save my setting. So I'll click my cut button and I click it over here. And now it's saying it could not connect to the silhouette, but that's fine. When I go back to my change settings window and I change my media and then I go back to my custom media, now you see that it, it has saved my settings. Now let's say I decide to go back, go down to three or whatever. Now if I cut it and go back to my media, and I change it around, you'll see that it has now saved it to a thickness of three. I don't need to go back in there all the time. It's just whatever I last cut is how it will save it. So I hope that helps you out with uh, adjusting your settings for vinyl.